<laughs> what is up, everybody? <laughs> Welcome back to Risk of Rain 2. And uh, we got a couple new uh, quality of life tweak mods. Uh, we have a s er artifact of swarm tweak. So uh, we uh, tweak its base drop rate just a little bit. Not Nothing too overpowered. So it still won't drop one uh, on every single fucking enemy kill. But we did double the drop rate from its normal one. Because sometimes when we play it with sp swarm, it just it never drops uh, anything. And, um, we also got some new difficulties, um, we haven't looked at yet. I can't slide over, thank you. So Illusion after, Charybdis. Yeah, so after Inferno, which we're, we have to tweak Inferno, because right now it is just absolutely disgustingly hard. But we got Delug De and Charybdis. Intense difficulty Deluge. for players really seeking a challenge. The planet forces, forces conspire against you. Okay. Moved for some reason. Yeah, let's start with Charybdis. Healing and health or regeneration minus 40%. Enemy cooldown minus 20%. Difficulty scaling plus 100%. Yeah. Just, it's more of a, a reduced visuals on teleporters, as if we don't have a mini map. Well, we're not running yeah. Charybdis, we're just no, no, running. No. So it's just, it's just a, a more vanilla difficulties. And um, I'll do my best to remember to link these down below. I got any new mods we add, I need to start remembering to link their. Uh, their page down below to make it easier for you guys to find them. But as always, if you have any questions on any mods we use, just feel free to ask. And we will answer as soon as possible. We oh well, I just got a drop of an item the second I fucking. We only doubled it. It was base set to five. The base game is five. Um, we just set it to ten. Okay. Uh, I also have a tweak for the artificer that I downloaded a while ago and just haven't played her. Um, it's just a new flame bolt. That scales based on um, fire rate instead of well. Item over here for you. Yeah, I see it. So we'll get some syringe. Yeah, yeah. We'll tweak the uh, item mod, or we'll tweak. Did I not grab an item? I thought I did. Uh, we'll we'll tweak the like drop rates if we find that we're dropping like way too many items, stuff like that, but. A 10% um, chance, I feel, is fine. I don't know if it's 10%. Yeah, it's not. Or if anything, if they're dropping a shitload of items, we'll just turn on the, the times two off. We can always just disable the Gudaka or put it down to one for now. Yeah. But, I mean, if we're going to be working on harder difficulties, we're going to need more items anyways, so... We'll just start playing on bad shit difficulties, and that's how we'll balance it out. Okay, so the fireballs still kind of are based on um, uh, cooldowns. It's just there's way more bolts in between, and the cooldowns a lot faster. But it does, again, it does do less damage, even though it seems like I'm still fucking falling these guys. Oh, so this is the ult. I haven't used this one. Before. Oh, hold on. The Santa Shrine of. You're skipping your dick off. Unfortunately. Can you hear me all right? Yeah, I can hear you. You haven't, you haven't cut out yet. And then I go kaboom! Definitely an interesting. Oh, it's up in equipment. Oh, let's go. All right, never mind. Yeah, never mind. I, I see it. I'm not doing a. Sh I'm doing fucking some small amounts of damage. I need gasoline. The more shit I set on fire, the better. Ignition tank. Let's go. One of these runs, we're gonna have to just ban the use of that, bro. It's just so broken. It ain't broken. Working just as intended. <laughs> it's just hilarious. Yeah, um. That's a lot of items. Maybe 10 is too much. 
think we went overboard. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I'm dropping an item like every five kills. I don't know what I don't know how the base scaling is. It makes to me it made no sense. Maybe we should just do this and go straight to Inferno. I want to do it. Say fuck it. Uh, well, we're already on a run. Might as well just continue. Uh, I would, you know, we're on the first stage, though, so it wouldn't have mattered. Plus, I'm also getting latency for whatever reason. Oh, I gotta check yeah, if something is downloading. No, nothing is downloading, so why am I... Okay, yeah, this is, um... Oh, a legendary. Yeah, I, I think this is broken. <laughs> if you see, if you can see my screen, there is at least forty items on the ground. Oh yeah. Okay. We'll see what happens. Uh, we already know. It's only gonna, gonna make Mythric stronger. I don't know. I'm pretty sh pretty sure with what's gonna happen. <laughs> pause after every set of video, every couple of video, or a couple of places. I think we might have to, for balance sake, maybe we can pose an item limit. I still have so many items, holy shit. Let's just become absolute. You know what? Fuck it. Let's um just speed run. Speed run the Mythrix. After this. Sound good? Yeah. Let's see how fast we can get the Mythrix. So like we're not picking up anything no, no, else. No, no. We're we'll, just we'll going pick items. We'll teleporter. pick up items. But we're gonna go straight to the teleporter, and we only get the items that drop from doing the teleporter. I want to. Oh. If you if an item drops while we're killing him to get to the teleporter, it doesn't count. Let's not pick him up. Then we just fucking speed run this bitch. Oh, I forgot. You need to start it. Okay. Yep. We're already. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Oh, sorry. Oh, my God. Oh, no, this is not fair at all. Okay, yeah, we went a little over. We are the train conductors. We are going to have to tweak the drop rate down. I'm going to put it back down to 10 for non-swarm runs, and maybe we'll go to, like, fucking 7 for swarm runs. Or maybe put it back down to base. Maybe it auto-tweaks Maybe it auto -tweaks it to begin with. That could be a thing. Well, yeah, just it does. Because ten is the auto tweak. Well, because no, I just I just read it as ten being the base, and I just assumed that's what it was in game. No, five is the base. No, I know that's what it says, but I don't know if it's a base in game or that's the base tweak for just the mod. I am telling you that ten is the base with the mod, five is the base without it. I feel like the game calculates it differently versus the mod, though. Yeah. <sighs> okay. I mean, we can test it off recording. We could just put it back down to base, come to swarm, and see what the drop rate is. Because there's been times Le where legitimately the mod creator has the base values of the vanilla game. Well, then I don't get the page. I don't get how the base values then because they wasn't dropping us a fucking damn thing before. I mean, you remember. There was, yeah. one, there was one where we killed literally like fucking 80 enemies and didn't drop a single fucking item for either of us. Oh, two 
greens. I didn't want to get a team, but whatever. Zoom zoom, buddy. Zoom zoom. Just starting the portal. Good. Okay. okay, the burn damage. Holy fuck. Problem solved. Problem solved. <laughs> yep. I always, I always wonder why sometimes, um, it. It, the the uh, portal items are instants and sometimes they're not. Kind of weird. Yeah, it's confusing to all shit. I feel like uh, there needs to be a harder a harder damage down penalty on this because this is just kind of a little broken for the artificer. Uh, mods are just meant to make the game play how you want it to. Nothing about balancing. We could do a run sometime soon. Another uh, um, <clears throat> item limit mo uh, run. We haven't done one of those in a while. Oh yeah, that would be that would be fun to do, most definitely. Now that we can actually get items clearly. We allowed to pick up a certain number of each color. Rarity, whatever you want to call them. Ow. How are you going? I'm actually, I've actually only been picking up items that drop inside the circle. Or mostly close to the circle, I guess. Close enough. Also, been trying to grab other non like stacked items. Get on out of here. Maybe we can kill Mythrix again fast enough that we could just straight up just fucking skip, skip his the, fucking skip his phase again. I think that's what it is. I think you legit just have to kill him fast enough and he just doesn't do it. I never I never bothered to like look into why it was happening, because I didn't care. Cause you know the challenge of him just taking our items and then us getting fucking pooped on. It's kinda of funny sometimes. Yep. Just getting fucking destroyed. Right, I'm coming. I I apparently went the wrong fucking way. Alrighty. God damn. Oh, that was accidental. I shot one enemy inside the void. It chain reacted to half the enemies inside the void. I could just hear nothing but damage numbers. Uh, I gotta get more crowbars. All of my attacks explode, by the way. <laughs> I got Brilliant Behemoth, so... Uh, I got Pocket ICBM, which is why I took the uh, Disposable Missile Launcher. Then I grabbed some grenades. Or the Charger things to get more uh, uses. Yeah, if this is how powerful we're gonna be, maybe we can kind of fold the Inferno. We just 
been kind of putting it off because it's kind of hit or miss with the Inferno. Like, it depends on how fast you get the items or stuff like that. Just because that difficulty fucking... It, it doesn't start very bad, but... Once you're 20 minutes into on the Inferno, the, the scaling it, is, like, so it fucking ridiculous. Terrible. Absolute poop down. Oh! I think you got it. Yep. And you're dead. Oh, no, never mind. I guess I forgot. I have a range limit, I guess. I think I can float indefinitely. What? I said I forgot I can float indefinitely. Um, I don't, I don't mean to go where I am. I, I have. I like a jetpack tweak on the fucking uh, artificer. Because once you lose momentum while floating with a jetpack, that's it. You're, you're just, you gotta just fall to the floor. That's about it. Because you can't go anywhere. You just gotta fall to your death. Vandalier. I'm just grabbing random shit. <laughs> yeah, at tone. this point. Jaro's band. Getting two of everything. Repulsive summer plate. Uh, it's a good way to test our build. Bitter root. Yeah, but just having one of everything. <laughs> or two of everything well, in this case. By just building. Oh, that could be interesting. Probably. What? A run where we're only allowed to grab one stack, one double stack of everything. That would take an immense amount of setup, too. No, it's just no. It just means you have to go down the list. It just, I'm not saying we have to finish the run with one stack of everything. It's just like say you're only allowed to grab two syringes, two glasses. Then we have to just continue. We have to continue down the list and just have a run based on only that item, those items. And then if yeah, we go that through, definitely would be weird. And then if we go through the whole list, we start back from the top, and then we get another double stack of syringe, and then a double stack of glasses, you know, stuff like that. I feel like that would be interesting. We should try that. Obviously on a tweaked thing, so we're not dropping an item every fucking four kills. Apparently double was just way too fucking broken. Bro, what the fuck? Oh. Wait, where are you? Oh, did it kick you? Uh, I think so. I have a black screen. Oh, you. Nope, I'm good. Uh, it killed me. Oh. Okay. That's annoying. I can't get you back. Oh, wait. You're here. Yep. Okay. Jesus Christ. I, <laughs> I was worried for a second. <laughs> Look at how many syringes I have stabbed into my ass. Look at my entire body since I have two Come of here, look. everything. Jesus Christ, you fucking crack, dope you fucking crack fiend. I almost said dope fiend for a second. Thirsty for the syringe. Uh, I'll go right, you go left. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to hook up a fucking hangout. This week. Hook up a fucking hangout. Yeah. I don't want to give out too much information. <laughs> no, it, like, it, it just the way you said it. <laughs> it was a very 80s way to say it. Hook up a hangout. Oh, shit. No, we're good. Okay, yeah, Mythrix is about to get fucking rocked. His first two phases, at least. Like, I'm sorry, bud, but you're getting fucking shit on. If he even spawns.
in the long arduous Damn, part. Nothing even spawned over here. I got like a couple of things and they don't. That's it. What the fuck was that? No, that was it. It was it completing for you. So, how's the weather up there? Over there. Pretty down good. There. Been fucking over there would make a lot more sense. But. It's been very fucking hot and moist over here. It's ridiculous. It, it's been warm-ish on certain occasions, uh, like and then 86. We went out to fucking go to a diner and fucking uh. We it's been the a weight, lot of the wait was a little long and oh my fucking god. It was it's been a lot outside. of rain. Well, that's the problem. There's been a lot of rain here too, but it's like been like 90 degrees and then it rains a little bit. And then it's extremely humid at 80 degrees. It's been not fun. It's been making me not want to do anything. Cause I'm like, it's just fucking. I sweat standing still. It's just like, like I'm too fat to skip. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> ah! No. Fucking mistimed the jump and the fucking band just shot me off the into the chasm. It's also wild that the moon, the moon for of Petrichor, like that we're on the fight Mithrix, is just like being held together by like world tree roots type shit. Yeah, it is weird. It's kind of interesting. I'm sure there's a lore base around it that we don't know or haven't read, so. Uh. That one didn't even give me any rewards. I finished the Pillar of Blood way too fast. Oh, get out of here. No, that looked extremely weird for my POV. What? When you teleported, like, it looked... It looked... It, look, it sounded like it actually caused a sonic boom. Like, you went past the speed of fucking sound. That is weird. There he is. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Oh no, too long. Oh no, no. Not too late. He's dead. What the fuck? Uh, yeah, we killed him. I didn't even... I used my ultimate and hit him. And he died. Yeah, I think, uh... That was too much. I'm sorry, Matrix, but you're. Yeah, we're not even getting a <laughs> fucking face. It's over. Game's done. That's it. Yeah, that was too many items. All right. Um, if that wasn't as entertaining, folks, sorry. <laughs> We're messing with mods and we had no idea what the scaling actually is for it. Like the way it's- oh shit, almost, almost killed myself. Uh, so we definitely made it. Double was a little too fucking much. So I think we'll go to like seven or like six instead of- we'll just raise it a little bit. Yeah, a bit too much. Fun. A bit too much. I wish- well I wish that the- the mod, instead of it being like the way the base scaling is, it's just, you could just set the amount of enemies required for it to drop something. I feel like that would be a little more balanced. Or at least a, easier to balance, not more balanced, in a way. I can only imagine what a 100% item drop rate would look like. I mean, we're fucking, sometimes we were practically fucking there. But yeah, that would be ridiculous. But yeah, I'm thinking, um, I think we should do that. Uh, we should do the I uh, item roulette or item rotation. That should be our next video. Just have to cycle. We have to cycle through everything on the list. Or I guess we don't have to cycle through it, but we could, uh, we just, we can't pick something more than once in a row. If that makes sense. Yeah. So if you grab syringes, you can't grab syringes again until you have at least one stack of everything in common.
I think I think that'll be the, I think that'll be the way to go. I think that's gonna be our next video. So I look forward to that. You're getting a sneak peek at what hap what's happening next. Um, but roll it outro, bit home slice. Skip. Skip. You roll it. You do the intro. You do the outro. Fuck you. Well, uh, that was a quick one. Just because I figured we were super busted by the first sage. So it said, fuck it, let's go beat his ass as fast as possible. And we did. We, I think that was the fastest we've ever killed Mithrix ever. But with that being said, if you liked the video, please uh, subscribe and comment down below any thoughts and prayers or uh, things you want us to try, play, or do. Uh, join our Discord so you can um, chat with us. There's been a couple new people have actually joined. Um, thank you guys for joining. Thanks to everyone who joined. I think we're almost at 50 members now total. I know a bunch of those rolled over from your previous server, but I think about 30 of them are new. Um, so, welcome. Thank you, guys. Um, you feel free to comment or even tag us in anything anytime. You can send stupid memes. You can send pictures of your dogs in any one of the channels, whatever. And uh, But with that being said, we will see you guys in the next video. We are going to do a item roulette or item circulation, whatever the fuck I decide to title the video whenever it goes up. And we will see you guys next time. Peace out. See you later, everybody.